By watching all the previous videos, you have an overview of how to use Roxim to make simple designs. Your next question is, well, where's the help? You know, what if I have a question? Well, there's several different places you can go for additional help. The first is this button up here. This is called the What's It This button. And if you click on this and then you click on another button, it will give you a quick overview of what that button does. For example, the 3D view button displays the rocket design as a 3D model with full camera control. Um, so that's the What's This button. And you can click on different things and try it out. The uh, next help button is the, uh, the contents up here from the help menu. And this will bring up the official Roxim help manual, which is actually uh, this thing right here. And it gives you several different ways to search for the different things that you're looking for in Roxim and how to use it. And this is the official guide, and I urge you to read it. Now, if you like to have something that's printed out, um, this guide is also in PDF form. And you'll find that if you close everything out. If you find your Roxim folder, uh, open that up, and then you'll find a folder called Doc. And this is our documents, the help documents. And uh, you'll find the Roxim PDF. Uh, you'll find the PDF for the engine editor. And this is the assistant, which we just saw. Uh, the, there's additional help on the Apogee Components website. Um, and I'll bring that up. And if you go to the page called Roxim underscore FAQ dot ASP, that's frequently asked questions about Roxim. This is uh, your guide to how to use Roxim that other people have asked me questions about. If you enjoy these series of videos on how to use Roxim, I will be having some other videos available on using the advanced features of Roxim. But there will be a small fee for these, however, uh, because all the information is actually in the help manuals, which I just showed you. Um, so this concludes the series of videos on how to get started using Roxim. Um, I hope you will uh, share your experiences with us, and um, I, I am sure you will enjoy using Roxim. So uh, thank you, and have a good day.